Hi, Wish Genders. This is Tessa, and you're watching The Wish Salon. So today, we're going to do chic, deep French nails like this. So I've already have my base coat on, applied, and I'm going to use two colors by Miss Q's. One is a sandy beige and another one is a rosy beige. So first, with the sandy beige color, I'm going to put it on my uh, middle finger and my thumb. And then use the rosy beige for the index and the pinky finger. Now I'm going to leave the ring finger later so that I could give an accent to it. Let it sit until it dries. After your nails are all dried, we're going to use this navy blue by Miss Q to have a deep triangle French tip. This is just an eyeliner brush, We're dipping it into the nail remover. You want to remove the edge of the nails as one nail at a time because it's easier to lift off the nail polish when it's wet rather than when it's completely dry. One of the tips in drawing this triangle is that you want to focus on where you're going to start and the middle. So you want to start from here, then go and the angle as well. You want, do you want to have it like really pointy triangle or do you want to have it a less of a mild triangle? So from here, you would go. And then when you start on the other edge, you want it to have it parallel. So make sure you know where you're starting and then head towards the middle as well.
So after you're finished, let the French tips dry and we will apply a second coat. For the second coat, you want to apply it as thin as possible. And instead of going with the shape of the triangle, we're just going to go in a vertical motion. You want to finish the tip as well so that's all fully covered. So after the second coat, I'm going to start doing the accent for my ring finger. I'm going to use Midnight in Paris by Beige. And for this finger, I'm going to draw an arrow. So it's going to go on the opposite direction. Instead of going this way, I'm going to draw it this way. Make sure you find the middle and then go towards the edge of your left. Go towards the edge. Because it's not dark enough, I'm going to put another coat on. And to make it pointier, I'm going to pull this with a dotting tool just around the corner to give that last point. And let it dry. Finish it with a top coat as usual. I hope you guys liked it. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe below. Also, be the first to see my next coming nail art look by following me on TJ Makeup on Instagram and uh, TJ Makeup Artist on Facebook. Until then, I'll see you next time. Bye!